guys welcome back welcome back to vlogmas day eight here Stop. with Corey. say hey hi drew sickle say hi mama say hey. hi everyone and loves all right so uh, stop banging she look yeah he lost his first two i lost my teeth too and hers came out at the bottom too and you barely got any teeth all right so we're going to do a Christmas countdown. Um, if you follow Jocelyn, then you know that Veronica gave her a, um, put it down please, a Santa countdown. And so she was kind enough to bring me one to New York for Dallas and Corey. So let's look at it. All right. So it says, Santa's beard is very bare. On his chin, there is no hair. You gonna, you gonna read it? So each day, add a puff and puff of white, and when his beard is full, he'll come that night. So there's 24 circles on here. So we have to fill them all. Santa always comes on the 24th day of December. So we have to put one cotton ball on each day, and then when his beard is all the way full to number 24, he will. Then that's the night that. Santa comes, so you know when you wake up, it'll be Christmas. So, Corey, that's the money so, when Santa rises. We have some, okay, okay, so. <laughs> not Jesus, he ain't rising. We got some cotton balls, so we're already eight days behind, so we need to add, we need to find numbers one through eight. Where's number one and two? So, what you gotta put, we need glue you need to get the glue from Drew Sickle. The you KK C, uh, Corey C. You just caught me KK. Well, you look like KK. Well, I actually do look like my mom. You gotta pull. Oh. Pull the little piece off the top. Okay. There you go. So you can trade. You do one, she do one. So first one, put it on the number so it's easier. Don't put it on the glue because that's how it's going to get on the table. Yeah, I'm supposed to do it. Let me see. Put it on the number. Put the, like, put the glue, put the glue on, on the, the paper. number and then put the cotton ball. Use both hands and squeeze it tight. That's enough. You only need a little dab and then put the the piece of puff on. All right. So now find number two. Oh, no, mama. Damn. Leave it there. Leave Here, it. give her one. All right. Don't need a whole lot. Just squeeze it. Just a, a, just a tiny dot. Just a dot. There. This big. That's better than mine. Stop, 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 stop. You messed it up. You messed it up. Okay, at least it's still sticky. There, Santa. Yay, good job, Mama. You put one on. Find number three. Yep. What's after three? Four. Four. And I'm pretty sure four is after. This will collapse after every time. Uh, and then we get glue all on the table. And then we get a little bit sticky. We are going to be sticky. Don't push it in more. It's ready. It's right here. Don't go too close. We'll be able to see it. So uh, it's ready. No, no. What number? What number will you do tomorrow? We're gonna go right to nine. There. Tomorrow we're gonna go here. But if it says one through sixty. We're gonna go over here. They might go down. Then, when, when we finish all of these, and there's this one left, Santa has arised. Why are you taking all of these out? Santa will arise on this day. Look at this. Now you can put them all back in here. And, okay. also, and also, Santa's very long away. But this is fake Santa, because he doesn't have a beard yet. We're breaking them up there. Sorry. Still yeah, teen. <laughs> and also, if you don't know who this Why is. Why are you putting <laughs> it so close to my face? <laughs> so this is Drew. Hey, this hi, is Mama. This, this is Drew. Drew making a mess with the cotton balls. And, the, and this is cotton ball. These are my children, no cotton balls. Where's the cotton balls? Oh, there. Oh, there. Hey,
today I went to Ross on my lunch break. Now, mind you, I went in the hopes of finding some cheap Christmas toys for the kids as presents. Somehow I ended up in the clothes section and got stuff for myself. Just a small haul, but I want to show you. I got four items and I only paid $30 for all four. Y'all know I'm trying to build up my work wardrobe because I have to have, you know, business casual attire. So, found these pair of pants. And I like the fact that they're stretchy and they don't, um, they don't have like a button and all that stuff. But these were um, really nice. They were only $6. And then I found three shirts. Um, this one was four fifty, I believe, something like that. And it's just a nice, plain, um, pink colored shirt. And this another shirt. And this is like a a green minty light green color shirt and it's the kind that kind of it has a little extra length in the back which is good which means I could wear some like legging jegging tight pants with it because it covered my butt and then lastly I got this sweater which I thought was so cute Long sleeve knit sweater, very light. And this was um, $13.99. So, this is my very small Ross haul, but I'm very happy with the finds that I found. I just wanted to show y'all that. Oh, which brings me to the question of the day Where are you at in your Christmas shopping realm if you celebrate? Have you not started? Have you just started? Are you almost done? Are you completely done? I have not started at all. I have not bought one Christmas present, so that's why I'm at. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know where you are in your Christmas shopping if you want to be entered into this week's giveaway. Hey, uh, I've now made it to JT House because we're gonna have wine down Wednesday in a few minutes, but I am going to be trying eggnog for the first time so this is the Pennsylvania Dutch and it has, it says made with real dairy cream, rum, brandy, and blended whiskey. So it got everything in there. So I'm gonna try it cause I've never tried it. And a lot of people on yesterday's video were saying their favorite holiday drink is eggnog. So I don't know y'all, it's thick. Look at that. Look how thick it's coming out. She was walking on rocks. She walking on rocks. I can definitely smell the liquor in it. What did he say? Look at that. All right. We ready? I don't know why it's stressful to try stuff. It smells like it's gonna be good though. It's, gonna be good. it's good. This is Kisha's favorite brand. It's my favorite brand. So apparently there's other brands that don't taste as good. So we're gonna go with Pennsylvania Dutch. She like the Amish people anyway. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You like it? <laughs> it's like um, what is is that cinnamon? Toast I can. Crunch. Yeah. yeah, it, it tastes like a cinnamon toast crunch shot that you get on a cruise ship. Mm -hmm. It's probably that. You've been drinking it all this time. I've been drinking it all this time. <laughs> I like that. Wow. I thought it was gonna um, be like milk. I do not like the taste of milk, but this is more like a- Different brands taste different. I can taste the, the spice in it. Like cinnamon spice. Yeah. I could bang with the eggnog. Now I know a lot of people said on the, on the comments yesterday or today that they like homemade. Okay. I have no idea how to make homemade, but I can rock with this Pennsylvania Dutch one. And it already got the liquor in it. 
And right here, it's warm. It's going down nice and warm, so I can tell that it really got some stuff in there. I like this. So, I must say, this eggnog is a thumbs up for me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drink, I'm gonna drink this, I like it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to do all the stuff, hit all the buttons, and I'll see you for Vlogmas Day 9 tomorrow. Bye.